It was warm and dry over in Coeur d'Alene today, but for the last few days, cold wet weather has changed water levels around Post Falls and Coeur d'Alene. And it's affecting kayak rental businesses. Peter Choi shows us how cold weather put businesses on their toes. It's a beautiful day, so I thought I could put my feet in the water, but it's too cold for that now. And that's exactly what local kayak rental owners are worried about, causing them to have late start. The sun is up, and so is the kayak. Kayak Coeur d'Alene owner Paul Brown delivers kayaks and paddleboards to rivers and lakes around Coeur d'Alene. Hubbard Street Park is just right off here, uh, off the beach that we um, deliver boats to. Uh, as well as over by the river. The weather hasn't helped much these last few months. Because the water has been flowing too hard. You know, we the melt off a little later, these unseasonable temperatures, the rain. Yeah, so typically we would be putting you down the river to float around Blackwell Island and out to Cougar Bay, but right now we gotta, we got to get you on the lake. On the other side of the Spokane River, recent heavy rain is sending water gushing down the river. And the low water level is keeping other rental businesses on their toes. And then hopefully when the water rises, we can continue with the jet skis, boats, all that fun stuff. If you plan to take your kayak out this weekend, Deputy Chief of the Coeur d'Alene Fire Department says there are few water safety reminders you should keep in mind. You're looking at the weather forecast, tomorrow or Friday is supposed to be nice. Uh, but that doesn't give it enough time, doesn't give the water enough time to warm up. Uh, right now it's 56 degrees, so the water is still cold. Um, so you will become hyperthermic rather quickly. Simple, but important to remember. If you're going to go out in a kayak, wear a life jacket, have a plan, let people know where you're at and where you expect to be done, when you expect to be done and when you're going in. We're just waiting on the water as of right now. Uh, we're doing everything we can to prep for a preseason. Wow, that's a lot of water flowing through the dam right now. Now, with a big event like Ironman coming up next weekend, owners say they're hoping to get more people visiting their businesses. In Post Falls, Peter Choi, 4 News Now.